Hey guys, welcome to the Fight Ash channel. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel, it's so close. Thanks for supporting me, guys. The famous American trainer Teddy Atlas claims that the former United Heavyweight World Champion Anthony Joshua is an overrated boxer. According to the coach, Joshua has not won a single significant match in his career. With all due respect, fans in the United Kingdom love good losers. Joshua won the title by knocking out Charles Martin, who is not on any list of great fighters. He is overrated. I can't express my thought more clearly or give a better reason, but who did Joshua beat? He lost and lost by knockout. Well, in the last two fights he lost, but showed character. Still, AJ knockout rules who took the fight literally in the last minute. I really think Joshua has always been overrated, but he can bring a lot of money, Atlas said. The WBC World Heavyweight Champion Britain Tyson Fury shared his opinion about the potential fight with compatriot Anthony Joshua. To be honest, when two heavyweights enter the ring, anything can happen, and at any moment. However, I've always said what happens when I fight Joshua. He shuts out of the game. Here is what I will say. The fight will last 6 or 7 rounds, but it's not yet a fact that he will last so long. Fury said. American trainer Teddy Atlas shared his opinion on a possible fight between the British, the WBC World Heavyweight Champion Tyson Fury, and Anthony Joshua. Atlas believes that AJ will suffer another defeat and will most likely be knocked out. I think Fury can stop Joshua. I like AJ. He's a talented boxer and he's had a good comeback. I like it all. I'm not going to say that he has a fragile chin. But I want to say that Fury has a stronger chin. Joshua found himself in a dark place when he was in a cow by Ruiz, after which he returned to the lighted room. He sees the light even after two defeats, but after the fight with Fury, an eclipse may come again. Where does his confidence go after that? said Atlas. I got bored in retirement, but it's been five months since my last fight, and I've changed my mind. No one believed me anyway, did they? In any case, I would be able to find a lie detector in any case. I left the ring title account in order to win it again in the future and become a three-time holder of this belt. Ali was the only heavyweight who won three belts of the ring. I am motivated by the opportunity to compare with Ali in this regard. I want to show good results. Ali is one of a kind. He had three the ring belts. And I intend to catch up with him when I drag this middleweight into the ring," Fury said. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. If you really enjoy the content, then please, subscribe to my channel and keep watching the videos. If you are subscribed, then receive notifications about the release of new videos. You do not even have to look for anything personally. I really want to get. 10,000 subscribers on my channel. I'm trying very hard absolutely every day and I need your support. Your likes, comments, reposts to social networks. Thanks for supporting me, guys. The president of the WBC, Mauricio Suleiman, didn't rule out the possibility of a fight between WBC heavyweight champion Tyson Fury and former belt holder Anthony Joshua. Fury held a mandatory defense in April. Now he is free to make decisions himself and the WBC will approve all mandatory title defense fights in November. Fury vs. Joshua is always interesting and special for the United Kingdom. Tyson is without a doubt the best heavyweight of our time and is in the prime of his life. At the moment, he doesn't have a mandatory duel. The WBC organized a mini tournament to determine the next contender. In the first stage, Andy Ruiz defeated Luis Ortiz. Next month, he will face the winner of the fight between Dante Wilder and Robert Hellenius, and Fury will enter the ring with a June 10 of this fight. The WBC approved these two fights, Suleiman said. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.